Let's see how we can use nested if else statements in C programming language. To illustrate that, I will take a score for five subjects from the user and calculate its percentage and accordingly display the grade for for the marks scored. Grade system is present on the computer screen right now for you. 60 to 100 means grade A, 50 to 59 is B. 40 to 49 is C and below 39 is fail. So I'll calculate the average now and the percentage based on that five subjects. Now in this program we are not going to use logical operators or else if statement. We are only using if and else. We can uh, use nested if else in this. So, once the user checks for this, if the percentage is above or equal to 60, we will display grade A. The else block gets executed only if the percentage is less than 60. So, these conditions. So, I'll check if percentage is greater than or equal to 50 now. So, if the else block is executing that means the score the percentage is obviously less than 60 so i'll check the percentage is above 50 which means 50 to 59 now if this else if block also doesn't get executed this is percentage if the percentage is less than 50 then we need to check for greater than or equal to 40 so even this statement is false means i need to display that in else block that you have failed that is your percentage is below 40 so this is it so i am just showing you how nested if else works using this program uh, this this program can be better programmed by using if else that is else if and logical operators but for now let us learn nesting of if else statement like this see it gets complicated if overall nesting deepens so that's what i wanted to show you in this program so next up i'll be showing how to uh, how to execute the same program using else if statements in c so write this program and execute this for yourself and check the logic visit the link present in the description section of this youtube video for more explanation and notes on this video also link to the same program which I have written using else if statement without using this nested if else statements. It will be a lot easier than this. So I hope it helps. Let's execute it. We have some errors here in line number 8. So let's check that. Okay. We need to store the values in the address of these variables. Let me compile the program once again. Okay, now it's working. So let's check for percentage above 60. So I'll give everything above 60 and below 100. We have not checked for condition above 100. We will do that in future videos. This program is just to show you, illustrate the nested if else statements. Now I'll go with the percentage for grade B. Now let's check for grade C. Everything below 49 and 40, grade C. So anything below 40, that is till 39, it's called fail. We check this video, enter the values for yourself 
and make sure you are subscribed to our youtube channel and to our blog and do not forget to share this video with your friends on social media sites and please do not forget to like this video on youtube thank you